My name is Abigail and I'm studying at the University of Glasgow for a Master's in Geospatial and Mapping Sciences. It's so good to get a chance to do some like practical work and uh, get down and go out on the Clyde on a nice little boat. It was really nice to see lots of the stuff that we've been learning about in theory, seeing pictures of it, seeing videos. It just doesn't compare to actually being able to see it in person and it all kind of comes together and makes sense once you see it work, all, work, all the systems working together basically. An advantage of the course at Glasgow is that you do get this um, practical aspect of it. You get to sort of see a project from start to finish. So you're collecting the data yourself and then you're processing it and then you're writing the report on it, um, which I think gives you a much better understanding of kind of the process as a whole rather than just being given the data and kind of looking at some numbers and thinking, oh, what, do, what do these mean kind of thing, trying to interpret them that way. I don't have a um, direct academic background to this master's. Um, I studied Spanish and linguistics my undergrad um, and then I worked in hospitality for a number of years and this master's was an opportunity for me to have a complete kind of like career change. Doing a master's course in this way, um, especially because of the kind of uh, practical aspect, the hands-on aspect of it, you get a lot of kind of industry specific skills you're kind of learning about a lot of the background, a lot of the, of the technical aspects and a lot of the theory that goes into a job that you would potentially not even knew existed when you were starting the course, if that makes sense. So if you're not coming from like the typical like geography background, possibly even the existence of like surveying as a discipline is, is not very well known. It's not your usual engineering, doctor, dentist, lawyer kind of thing that you learn about in school necessarily, but it's like an integral part of construction, so civil engineering, energy networks, all that kind of stuff. So yeah, it's interesting to kind of see all of that it's definitely been a steep learning curve, that's for sure. But an advantage of the course is that there's no expected prior understanding. So each of the modules are designed such that if you have no background in it, you will finish the module um, exhausted, but you'll, you'll know everything. It's definitely preparing me in a very direct way for my next career step. The course is providing me with like very practical skills, just all the things that you would need to kind of go into an interview with confidence to be able to say to an employer, you know, I might not know everything about what you're doing yet, but I can prove that I have the skills to learn. So I think it, it's going to kind of equip me with the skills and the background to be able to make a good choice for my future career. Mm -hmm.